You're 100% sure this serum will work, right? I'm not only sure, I'm certain it'll work. Well, if there's no side effects, I'll buy your super soldier serum, the formula, and the equipment to test it. Dr. Osborne, are you sure it's a good idea to test the serum one week after the previous failure with Octavia? Dr. Smith, I understand your concern. But this deal with Fisk Industries is one that will expire in a week. If we don't test it now, Fisk could take back the loan providing our funding, and we could really get put in the ground this time. Well, I'm not sure it's a good idea to rush the experiment so soon. What if the serum fails and you go mad? Then Fisk will get the blame because of his funding. I... I see. Norman? Norman? The adrenaline shot! <laughs> what? What happened? You flatlined. Relax while I call an ambulance. Wait. Norman! No! Mr. Osborne, there's a call for you from Oscorp headquarters. They said it's very important that you come to your office. What happened? Philip said there were several vials of performance-enhancing serum and needles stolen from your office. The security tape from yesterday was also taken, and the camera was destroyed. Who would do this? Should I prepare a more formal suit? Good idea. Norman Osborne? Yes, that's me. My name is Detective Frank Castle. I was assigned this case. I heard some reports that you were here late last night. Do you remember anything? I don't remember anything significant. I just remember staying late for research. So your office wasn't trashed when you left? Of course not. I always make an effort to keep my office clean and organized at the end of every day. I see. You should take a day off and try to get some R&R. I have felt a little overworked lately. Do you really trust Osborne? He's not exactly the epitome of trustworthy. No, I know he lied about something. I'm just not sure what he lied about. The detective was right. I feel better already. Hey, watch it, bro. Hey! These shoes cost me $5,000! You're lucky you didn't scuff them up! Let's just go. I'm sorry. I've been very stressed out lately. No, here. I didn't mean... to... snap. <sighs> Maybe I should check the Daily Bugle. Spider-Man supposedly stopped a mugger earlier today! But our photographer, Eddie Brock, says he saw Spider-Man running away from the victim with her purse! Spider-Man is a menace and a fraud! Everyone in New York looks the other way! Nobody goes in to stop a mugging if he isn't being paid to! Mr. Jameson, you might offend someone by saying he, perhaps you should say they. Do I look like I care? Who gets I can't believe people listen to that. Come on, Spider-Man's a hero. If not for him, I would be six feet under right now. Oh my, time to get moving. I might miss my meeting with the marketing department. Well, I think if we try to market towards a younger crowd, now let's say high school age and make some products for them, we could practically double our monthly profit in areas like antiperspirants, tech, and... You know something, Max? I need to call this meeting short. I need to run an errand for Harry. I understand. I suppose I can email the rest of you later. Glad we're out of there. It was more boring than Thanksgiving at Catherine's house. Wait a sec. That's Norman. 
Where'd that briefcase come from? Hey, that looks like Dr. Smith's briefcase from earlier. It is Dr. Smith's. <laughs> that wimp Osborne's none the wiser to my brilliant plan. Operation Goblin is a go. And I said, you're finished. And I kicked him to the sidewalk. <sighs> I need a side hit. Oh no, that can't be good. Baby! <laughs> Forgot nobody's home. Knock knock! Impressive. Most impressive? Don't push it, pal. You're right, we just met. I gotta make a good first impression. How's this for a first impression? Yikes, sturdy pole, old man. Kinda like it. Give up yet? Ha! Truth? Hello? You there? Huh? Oh, yeah, I'm here. Sorry, I had a rough night last night. Pets? Not pets. Aunt May's allergic. I tripped on the stairs and got my back and face all scuffed up. Oh, do you want me to look at them? I am in the nursing class at the vocational building. I... I... Sure. All right, then. This is going to be a little awkward. Take off your shirt. M my shirt? You said your back was scuffed up. Probably just some bruises. Okay, I can get some ice while you take it off. You know what? I'll just... Tough out the ones on my back. Why don't you treat the ones on my face? Sure. Come here. Quick question. Yeah? How do you get a busted lip from falling down the stairs? Uh, there's no fooling you, is there? I dabble in reading detective books. I can tell. So how did you really bust your lip and get your back messed up? I got in a fight. You? Got in a fight? Yeah, I, I did. Who was it? It was some random guy. He tried to mug me. Beating up a mugger? Who do you think you are? Spider-Man? No way. What? Is this real? No. I should not have done that. You're Spider-Man? Don't, don't freak out. Have you? Ha have you killed anyone? No, no I, don't, I, don't, I don't do that. Does your aunt know? No, she'd kill me for it. She would not approve. How long? Three months. I need some time to think about this. I, I understand. I'll see you on Monday. I can't believe you, Osborne. What was I supposed to do? I can't kill Spider-Man. You can and you will. Spider-Man is the one thing in your way. Without him, you could rule this city. I don't want that. Of course you do. Every man wants power. I want to earn power. Rise to the top. Fair and square. Fair? Fair is for children at play. You are a man and you need to claw your way up. Did you really think you can make it on your own? I've been here since your father. Don't mention my father. He never supported me. I always supported you. 
I've always been here, and I'll always be here. Face it, you're stuck with me. Why did you begin acting up now? You know, a little steroid, some shocks, and a hint of adrenaline. Put them together and you get me. You can't expect me to listen to you just because I'm stuck with you. Believe me. You will. Dude, you would not believe the glitch I found in Doom last night. Tell me about it. Alright, so I just beat the Gorness in the BFG division when... Pete, can I have a word with you? Yeah, I'll be right back, Harry. Hold that thought. I've been thinking about what happened Friday night, and I just want to say that I support you. Y you do? <laughs> that's a... that's a relief. I thought you'd want me out of your life. Actually, I want the opposite. What are you saying? I want you to be my boyfriend. That's... That, that's great. I, I've... I've liked you for... A long time. I know. How about that? Actually, I've liked you for a long time, too. That's why I always ask to be your partner in Dr. Connor's class. Whew, I hate being socially awkward. I'm a little awkward myself. So does that mean we're... A thing? I guess so. I know what that look means. Congrats, bro. Well, I'll leave you two alone. Talk to you later, Pete. Does Harry know? Should he? Oh, I see. I, I mean it. Should Harry know? Nah, let's just keep this between us. I gotta get to history class. I'll see you around. See you later, Pete. And so, in 1776, the Founding Fathers signed the Constitution of the USA. Yada, yada, yada. You guys get it. Let's take a short breather, guys. Meet back here in five minutes. Hey, Mr. Campbell. Uh, I have some questions about tonight's homework. Sure, Pete. What is it? Well... I think I just figured it out. Never mind. Thanks anyway. Smart kid. A little weird, but smart. Where's that spider punk? Were you looking for me? Indeed I am. I want a little rematch after Friday night. Can we make this quick? I got a cat stuck in a tree I need to get to. Joke all you want. I'm gonna give you quite the beating. We'll see about that. You're just gonna walk away? Look, buddy, I'm busy. Maybe we can rematch next week. See you around. Yes, you will. So, why did you miss third and fourth period? Can you guess? That's inconvenient. Yeah. How did you do? Knocked him out. Want to get a milkshake to celebrate? You bet I do.